This is how to use a slider in AppLab on code.org. Start at your dashboard and click Create an AppLab for a new empty project. In design mode, go all the way to the bottom and grab a slider, stretch it out as far as you can, and then you need something that you're wanting to change with the slider. I'll start with just a label, and I'll just put the word code on there. You also need to move this little box to the corner and grab the edge of it and make it as big as you can. Okay, uh, now we're ready to code. So what we're going to do is grab an on event and set it to the slider. And whenever the slider changes, then we're going to set the font size of this. So I need to get a set property. There it is. We're going to set the property this time of the label. And we're going to set its font size. And now here's something kind of critical. What size do we want to set it to whenever the slider changes? Well, we'd like to set it to whatever number the slider is at. So to do that, we're going to have to hold that value with a variable. So let's go get the first variable block and stick it inside the on event. And let's call it size. And we're going to set that size equal to a get property over here in yellow. I always have trouble finding this one. There it is. We're going to get the slider's value. All right, and once we have that and it's named size, then right here, the last blank where we were going to select the font size, we can just put the word size. Let's try that. So move this. As soon as you let go, it's going to resize the text. All right, I did 0 to 255 because I was thinking about colors in a minute, but you could also do back over here in design. On your slider, you could go 0 to 1,000 if you wanted to. Let's try that gets bigger faster. All right, you can use sliders to affect the size of a font or of a picture or even colors.